Hey folks, it's Mike Murphy and today's quick tip is in Photoshop CC. I'm going to show you how to replace the artwork inside of a smart object. The great thing about smart objects in Photoshop is it allows you to do designs and easily swap out the images. So when you create something as a smart object, you basically can just replace whatever is in that smart object, update it, and then the new artwork will display without having to do anything else. So you can tell a smart object, if you look in the corner of the thumbnail, there's a special little icon that tells me that this is a smart object right here. So a lot of the templates that you get for free or that you pay for online will use smart objects because you can put artwork in there and it's really easy to swap them out with your own artwork. And these are great for your own workflow. If you're doing a lot of different images for social media or whatever, you don't have to change the whole template. You just need to swap out the smart object. And any effects or filters that you put on a smart object, you can always go back and edit. So they're really handy and and they're non-destructive. So to swap out the artwork of a smart object, there's a couple ways to do it. You can right click on the layer and you can choose replace contents or you can choose edit contents. Or the way that I like to do it is just double click on the thumbnail itself in the bottom right corner. It's gonna open up the layer that has the artwork on it. So anything you change in here, once you hit save, it's gonna update the design. So I'm gonna to go to file, place embedded. I'm gonna go find the artwork that I wanna replace this with and just use this one. Here's a new t-shirt that I just designed, podcaster. I'm gonna hold the shift and option key to scale it up proportionately. I'm gonna hit commit, close out the layer. It's gonna ask me, do you wanna save it? Yeah, I wanna save it. Now you can see here that it updates just like that in the iPad in the same perspective, exactly the way it should look. So now we'll go to the iPhone, we'll do the same thing. We'll double click on the thumbnail itself, open up that layer, we'll go to file, place embedded. I'll go grab another logo. I'll grab the green podcaster T, close it out hit save, and just like that, I have my artwork updated. So that is how you swap out artwork with smart objects in Photoshop. Cheers.